Greetings, fellow Portal Masters. Greetings, fellow Portal Masters. I am Crash Rouse. I am once again time to Crash Guns with another episode of the Skyler Rounds, the half hour here on the channel. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to episode. I'm supposed to edit in a thing there, but I probably won't. Uh, we're still in the process of building things. My shelves were supposed to arrive last week, but they did not in the time of me recording this. And uh, they still haven't arrived yet, so they're taking their sweet time. It's supposed to be here on the 17th, it's the 24th of me recording this, so yeah, awesome, hey? But ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be happening in the future, so this is going to be here just for a little while longer until so it's all set up. It's nice anyway. Ooh, ooh, smooth. What am I talking about? It's the On Sapphire, ladies and gentlemen. This is a show where I take every single Skylander ever. So it's a series two, three, and four variants along. Uh, for, it's three and four and variants. I know what I'm talking about. I've done this before, I swear. And what I'm doing is I'm taking whatever Skylander it is and giving him a half hour. And by the end of the half hour, I'll have a definitive rating of one to five. Five being the best, one being the worst. I did it backwards. But anyways, every single Skylander, right? So Crash, you're saying to yourself, yeah, I'm saying to myself, you guys, I'm tired. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I'm going to stumble a lot this episode. You're saying to yourself, how are you do you pick these Skylanders? Well, first of all, all my Skylanders, for now, are put away in these tubs. And every single Skylander in those tubs that have not been an episode of the Honest Half Hour are put into a random name picker. So I hit pick a random name and whatever Skylander comes up, that's the Skylander I'm delegating a half hour to. Well, you know. Roughly 20 minutes, because I delegate 5 minutes to intro and 5 minutes to an outro because I tend to ramble or, you know, talk complete nonsense. Ladies and gentlemen, we are not going to waste any more time. We had a pretty good episode last time with Whirlwind. Completely changed my mind. It's pretty awesome. But we are going to check out who we are giving a half hour to right now. There's always lots of good names still in it. Every single game represented. Today we have... Shark Shooter Terrafin. Here we go. So Shark Shooter Terrafin was that Skylander that was already great. I'm a fan of Terrafin. I did a half hour in it. I think I did not see half hour of him already. Did I? I think so. I forget. I forget some of the most of the Skylanders I do. But they released a different version for Superchargers, and it was Shark Shooter Terrafin, so he gets a gun. Why did they make new Skylanders have guns? Like, Super Shot Stealth Elf, she's coming up in a future episode. Why do they do that? Anyways, it's Shark Shooter Terrafin time. I've already been very vocal about this one, especially on Ring of Heroes. Why do they have him? But yes, we're going to put him on the portal and get this started. Spoiler, Supercharged is my favorite game, so I'm going to be talking about that a lot. Just saying. Supercharged. All right, ladies and gentlemen, timer has started 20 minutes on the clock. Shark Shooter Terrafin time. So, Shark Shooter Terrafin is fully leveled up because of the fact that he was part of the Supercharge lock a little while ago. So you see he has all of his abilities. I want to bet the top path is always because I like the fact that you can shoot sharks. That's it. That's the literal number one reason. I like the fact that he can shoot sharks. Um, we're going to be able to, you know, we're going to try to have to use all of his abilities, basically. Oh, the belly flop move. Or oh, wait. This could have been a decent one. What's this, what is it? Press triangle during Earth's one blast to launch three sharks. SAS missiles do more damage on the way back down. Holds to rare release or find more than some of the same. Okay, let's see. Alright, okay. I haven't played a shark shooter terrafin since the uh, lock itself. And that was a while ago also, so... Oh yeah, right, right, right. That's what this does. You're going under and then... Okay, he comes up and shoots the ground, right? He doesn't do the belly flop unless you have the upgrade ability. So yes, that. That's cool. Come out, there we go. And triangle is the bash down. This move. Okay. It's not called the bash down, I know that. But yeah, alright, so that's, this is a good way to start. So what we do is supercharge as always. Ooh, hold on, we got some uh, stones. Throw some stones in the wishing mail first. Nice, get some experience I didn't need. And some gear bits I didn't need because I 100% this game a very long time ago. Alright, so we're going to go to a level like always. We're going to just kind of pick a random one maybe. Um, Captain Clocks? 
I'm driving in this one, so that's fine. Yeah, yeah we'll go to Captain Clux. There's a little bit of battling in this, too. I think that's a good uh, way to do it. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be doing a variety of moves. Like always with any episode, I'm going to try to do some combo attacks. Because you guys like when I do combos. And I'm not talking about those crunchy peanut pretzel rolls. I'm also going to be drinking some uh, President's Choice Power Quencher. Sponsored. Can someone please sponsor me? <laughs> I'm so lonely. I want to sell it so bad. Everybody in the comments say hashtag sponsor crash. And maybe someone will finally sponsor me. I want to get into this 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 this, this video. Come on, we are we already wasted. We already wasted three minutes somehow. Oh wait, this is my channel. Everything I do is a waste. I also looked at the clock when I could look at my recording right here. It wouldn't told me how much it was. Finally! I don't care. Here we go. Great that you notice that, I guess. Hello, I don't care. You're small now. What? Did you just get mad at me or something? Here we go, we do that. We do that. And we do that. There we go. I'm working on it. There we go. Nailed it. <laughs> we do actually fight enemies, though. That's the thing. Like, I'm not just going to be doing the big and small on all the enemies. If I'm not mistaken, you can make that bigger and give you more health. There we go. And make him smaller. We're going to use different abilities here now. So I think I'm going to go like this. And try to use my sharks. Okay, 21. So I'm gonna be supercharged too because I do have the um, shark tank out, it's, which is his uh, vehicle. Oh, you see that? I used a hammer on him. So now I'm just gonna use the, use the shark, the, the shark shooters or whatever you call them, the missiles, the missiles he has, the shark missiles. Go like that to get rid of you, go like that to shrink you, go like that, or, or not. Go like that to, go like that to grow you, perfect. And with you, here we go, we're gonna try this again. I love when he goes underground and starts singing to himself. Ooh, they, they're they homing, watch. Oh. Yeah, there we go, see one in the back did it. Awesome, we're gonna come out and see if we can hit him. Nice, okay. All right, got the hang of that already. To of you so basically, he's very similar to Terrafin, except he has a gun instead of punches. That's the difference. Most, that's usually the difference in everything. Is he has a gun and not punches anymore. Awkward. That awkward moment when... And Smash. Super Smash Bros. Who's your Smash Bros name? Leave it in the comments. Mine's Captain Falcon, because I don't take the game seriously. These big hands are blocking all the... Now I have a friend of mine who's actually a Smash Bros. Pro. I know I'm talking about something completely different here now. <laughs> it's not Skylanders. But uh, he's, a, he's a Smash Bros. Pro, but he's competed in tournaments and stuff. And he's always surprised how, how well I am holding my own with uh, Captain Falcon. Because all I do is just troll and I stand in this one and say, Show me a move, show me a move, show me a move. And he's like, man, you actually hold your own with him. I'm like, I oh, know. This is the only character I use. How could I not? <laughs> There we go. So also, I got some pretty exciting news I'm going to tell you guys in this video, because uh, it will be in a future video. I am working on getting a green screen. So you've seen probably in Jack's videos, he has a green screen moments and stuff like that. Uh, supposedly the editor that we both use has a uh, green screen capabilities in, like you can chroma key it out type thing. So in the future, I'm going to be looking into that. I currently have a green screen to use, um, so hopefully that'll work. Um, I got a... $80 green screen for five bucks. <laughs> so if I, if I can get it to work, like figure out and make sure how it works and stuff like that, I might do a video on how I set it up basically to help you guys with a green screen. Um, Harry, he'll, interesting enough, it's a Harry Potter robe and it has green screen capabilities. And so when I got it, I was just like, I told Jeff, I'm like, so this is basically a green screen for five bucks, which is awesome. My computer just decided to do a defender scan and found there's nothing on it, guys. Like right here is perfectly clean. Oof. Oof. Two people were talking at the same time then. Oh, 
I'm literally bumping into every single one of them. If you're looking for our founder and CEO, Captain Cluck himself, you should visit our treehouse offices. He's usually in there doing What does CEO stand for again? What does CEO stand for? Chief Executive Officer? I think that's what it is. So I've talked about numerous times how much I love superchargers. This is one of the reasons I love the fact that there's vehicles. Um, I talked about it in one of my, uh, I'm gonna say latest videos even though it's probably weeks old now. My top five favorite games, Superchargers is on that list, spoiler if you haven't seen that. Definitely go watch that one, it's my return to top fives, um, I'm working on another top five in the future. Right now I'm doing it every ranked video and I think I might do another quick top five before I do a very another special top five. Um, I'm doing this, I think I've already released it, I mean, hopefully at this time I've done it. I'm hopefully going to have it done for the weekend and we are recording it now. But I'm going to pick at it, I'm, not, I'm, yeah, I'm never in a rush to finish videos anymore. They'll get done when they get done and y'all watch them, that's all that matters, right? Yeah, exactly. So yeah, so I'm working on that one now and then there's a top five leading into that one, so. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I don't care. Those bumpers are dangerous. It's just like pinball, that's all. Watch. I'm gonna bump right into one and nothing's gonna happen. Watch, you ready? Ready? Watch this. Ready? I'll bump right into one. Ooh. Ow. That's so dangerous. Ooh. I totally don't lose health every time I bump into one. Oh, wait. Jumbo order of chicken coming right up. You are really affecting my. That guy just went way too far ahead. Oh, come on now. I know, I'm working on it, Tessa. If you're lucky, you're my favorite. There we go. Standing right in front of it, that somehow homes the other way. That's what I was working on. <laughs> We're just trying to get through this so we can get back to the actual character itself. Because as always, I don't judge the character on their vehicle. I don't judge the character on their look or anything like that. With this one, I'm just basically trying to get through this. My favorite thing is I'm clearly hit... Oh my gosh. What's the secondary mode? Oh, that one that does way less. Alright, we're just going to try to push it. Wasn't there like a show? Robot Wars? I think it was Robot Wars when... Uh, they had to do like these tasks and stuff, and one of them was like roll a ball into a goal and all this stuff. I think it was Robot Wars. Back in the day, there was a show Robot Wars. There's Battle Box out now. As far as I know, I think it's on like season finale right now, but uh, there's that show. Oh my gosh, come on. <laughs> Try rolling those big hens into the chutes. That gate won't open until you get a chicken into each chute. I know, it's gonna hit this bumper. This is a way to see if you have patience or not. Why are you doing this to me? It's gonna bump again. Thank you. Oh yeah, he destroyed the bumper. Thank gosh, that'll make it a little bit easier now. Probably it definitely won't. This will make it a little easier. It did not make it easier. Oh come on, we're almost there, baby. Yay! That took way longer than it needed to be. How much time did that waste? Nine minutes. That was creepy. I don't know if you guys heard that. <laughs> Flynn's like, tender chicken. And I'm like, okay. Hey, complete the land star, though, so that means I don't have to use that anymore. I'm gonna have to use that again. That's the, um, circle of trust training area, but we all call it the hen house. Here we go. Uh, did anyone else see a five story chicken walking around back there, or uh, <laughs> am I just hungry? <laughs> Flynn, that's not a chicken, that's a rooster. Idiot. Oh, are they always that big? Yep, they usually Hello, are. and welcome to Cap'n Cluck's King Size Chicken. We are currently experiencing some, uh, service interruptions due to, um, that thing. That is Agent 173, Cap'n Cluck's first successful rooster super soldier. Sorry, he I was to use the looking colossal at colonel to raise a whole army of them. Don't need to fight it. 
Don't want to fight it. Don't want to fight. Don't Skylanders care. Skylanders of the dark element are stronger in this zone. The dark element are stronger in this zone. Come on, please. Yay! Woohoo! First try. Thanks. There we go. All right, let's get to another battle here now, please. It's taking a while. Okay, if I'm not mistaken, there's little things coming. Perfect. We're gonna use just homers. Oh! Or I could just jump out the edge. Nice. We used homers. Homer missiles. Homers. There we go. Nice. Homing missiles did great that time. Is this a supercharger? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to this one. I think this actually has some battles in it. So that's really good. That'll help us out. Oh. Is it? Yes! Lots of battles. Perfect. Try bouncing on those enemies, Skylander. Then you come over here and you go. And then you come over here and you go boing. You get one of the big ones, and you go boing up here. And then you wait for one of these guys to come down, and you go uh, boing. <laughs> and then you wait for one of these guys to come down, and you go uh, boing. <laughs> and nailed it. Nailed it. Look at that. Pew. Go. Great work. Nailed it. Look at that. Flew through that one. Crash, you never even fought anything. I know. I'm gonna go fight these enemies. All I do is just boing out of the way. Oh, I missed that chocolate bar too. Oh well. <laughs> Why do you guys watch my videos? I'm not even doing really anything with Shark Shooter Terrafin. I'm just basically speed running, not even speed running this level. I'm just going through the level. Here we go. Yeah, there we go. Boom. Boom. All right. I'm just using the jump smack move right now. I'm using jump and triangle, that's all. Playing on play PlayStation 3 like always. Bam. Bam. Oh, look at that. Come here. Pew. Alright, we're gonna use just rockets on him. Alright. <laughs> Didn't even explain what I was doing. I was like, I'm just gonna I'm gonna use just rockets on him, and then he found out that it wasn't. Oh, the savory secrets it must hold. Come on. Why are you not doing? Why are you not doing the thing? There you go. I was wondering why that wasn't doing the thing. Oh, and this is the final battle clock. Okay, we're not doing that. It's no point. Let's go back to the map. We're not to the map. How much time we got left? Five minutes, okay. We'll head back to the academy, see if Tessa has something for us to do. I feel like I never really got a good feel of his moves. I think I chose the wrong level. <laughs> this was mostly just a, like I was, well, for the majority of us, I was doing that little chicken mini game that was there. So yeah, so that's not a good start. But yeah, I think I'm gonna just go talk to Tessa and see if she has some kind of battle arena, like maybe battle brawl. Um. If she has a battle ball island, then we'll do that. If not, I think I'm just gonna go over to Buzz and fight a couple of minions and just do each of the moves and see what they feel like. Let's see what Tess I got for us. What do you got, Tess? Ooh, dragon feather. The Sky Bandits have stolen. Sky Bandits, yeah, here we go, okay. This works too, I forgot about the bandit train. Look at her with her hat. Going like this. See? <laughs> Might have been too late. Probably never got to see it. Just gonna. I gotta work on a better, some kind of lighting here. I gotta get like a light right here or something. <laughs> I'll put a light behind the camera so it shines in my eyes at all times. <laughs> no, I'm not doing that. That's just dumb. That's just dumb. What I need is one of those little pucks you put on the wall and you like hit it and it turns on. You know? Or you can use one of those fancy lights all the vloggers use. Just kidding. That involves using another. Hit four enemies at Skylanders once with surface to air to surface missiles. I don't know what that what that is. Is it that thing? Here we go. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, nice. The surface to air missile thing was really good for um those grenades just then. 
I like that. That was what that was, right? Surface two air missiles. Come on. There and pew. Noise. Nailed it. Flying through this one. Flying through. You only got like two, three minutes left anyway, so. There we go. Oh, there's a move that I didn't use. I just realized. I forgot there was a move I didn't use. I didn't hold down square. Here we go. We'll go right here. With her. What? Hold on. Use not that thing. Hold the heck on. Hold the heck on. Come on over, guys. Come on over. Come on over. Um. Heckin' um. What was that thing? I didn't know it did that. I thought it was just a whirlpool that you know, get stuck in so you can just hit them. I didn't know a giant terrafin comes out and eats them. That's insanity. I love it. There we go. I'm almost done here now. I want to keep using that move. I'm going to use that on these guys again. Ready? Watch this. Ready? This is insane. I love this so much. Here we go. Watch, 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 watch. Ready, ready, ready. That's crazy. What the heck? Oh, I missed. Hold on. Oh, I'm stuck there somehow. Did I, did I get him? Did I get him? Did I hit him time? I did not. Get out of here. I gotta destroy these two guys so I can use them on the enemies. There we go. Cool. There's you. There's you. Only, oh, I never had to use it on him in time. I can't get over that giant, that giant shark. Oh my gosh. That's insane. I had no clue he did that. Oh, I got the boards. I got the boards. I saved them. I saved the boards. Two cans who are somehow still pecking the air, spinning around in circles. That's how it works. What time we got? Less than one minute. Yeah, we literally have like a couple seconds left. So I'm going to stop it here now, I think. That's probably the easiest way to do it. All right, yes. So... I think I have an opinion on Shark, shark Tank, on Shark Shooter Terrafin. I definitely do after the fact that I just saw that insane shark move. We're just going to discuss that now in a second. So, uh, yeah, let's uh, switch to just my face and discuss what just happened, <laughs> basically. So, I've already given my open opinions about Shark Shooter Terrafin and how the fact that I didn't think he needed a gun. Sorry about the blue screen right now. <laughs> the blue on my face. I'm a blue man group. Ooh. There we go. Um, so the fact that he is added to a gun, I thought it was really dumb. Because he was always a great brawler to begin with. He was one of those Skylars that everybody likes because of the fact he goes on the ground, he uses the brawler, he throws the things, all that stuff. He was great. So the fact that it gave him a new weapon, even though they didn't need to, it was one of those like, eh, don't know why they would do that. Now I see why. I think I gave Terrafin a 3. Sorry, once I was literally thinking that I have a hair in my mouth. Also, I was thinking I think I gave him a three. Um, I gotta say he's getting a solid four out of five this time. I know I'm doing the ranking early. I'm gonna discuss why. You're thinking why not a five out of five? Well, um, the land sea sharks. So that's the only move that I see me not using the most because you go underground, you shoot the sharks and stuff. But the thing is, you do that move and it does like the homing missiles, the homing sharks and all that stuff. But the gun does that itself. When you're just standing there pressing square, he shoots them and they home anyways. So why would you go underground and shoot those sharks out? You just go underground maybe to get maybe to do a speed run or to hit things underground. But I don't see me using that one a lot. The jumping smile move, I will definitely be using that one. I can see me using that where jumping either jumping air, hitting it, or just hitting triangle and just slam it down. And especially that homing missile move. I love that one. And you know the gigantic shark that grows from the ground. Like <laughs> That's really cool. So the only reason I, give him, I can't give him perfect 5 out of 5 is the fact that the surface to air to surface, I think is what it's called, missiles, that's something I would never use. So um, 
that it's just it's I could see where people could use it from. I know of people out there who are Terrafin fans and can definitely use it more than other ones. But for myself, I don't see me as that. So no reason I have to warrant a four out of five. I think that's a pretty fair rating. But that's up to you guys. Do you think he deserves a four out of five rating? What is your rating of Shark Shooter Terrafin? Let me know in the comments below. While you're down there, let me know who you're excited for in a future episode of the Honesty Half Hour. Next Tuesday, another episode. Who could it be? It could be anyone that hasn't come up yet. Except for series two, three, four, and variants, you know? Ladies and gentlemen, if you guys enjoyed, let me know simply by leaving a like and a comment below. But as always, I bid you farewell.